hundred pound. Have you got anything any cheaper? Oh, all right, no, thanks, 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 cheers. Everything's a fortune. <sighs> I hope we'll be able to get anything. How much did you say we had again, Mum? About two hundred. Here, try this one. That was the best punch I've ever seen, mate. What a fight have you gone all the way? Gone all the way, mate. Sir, so, look, OK, we can roll him now. Is he going to be all right? Just a precaution. Congratulations. Don't think anyone was going to get in your way today. Are you going to tell him or hey, why? Hey, 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 keep your voice down. Tell him. You don't know what you're talking about. The boy's been injured and you've been giving Bolton these pills. I told you, they are vitamin tablets. She's an English teacher. Have a look at those, please. What is going on? Why well, haven't they announced him as the winner? How much longer are they going to be, Eddie? We've got to go. Yeah. I told you we'd do it. Come on. Well, come on. Haven't they announced it yet? I don't know. I'm going to go and find out. OK, we'll, we'll get the kids on. Yeah. Listen, why don't you go and see Philip and ask what this lot have? What? What's that? Passport, I can't find my passport. You're serious, oh, Melissa. So have we won the fight or what? Hold on. We've just got to be satisfied that everything here is above board. How's the other lad? Is he OK? Uh, officials only, sir. Uh, I'm Eddie Lawson. Yeah, he's head, Waterloo Road. How many of these did you take? It doesn't matter how many you took. I'm not asking you. Six. Why did he give them to you? He said that they'd help me concentrate on the fight. There's nothing wrong with that. Did he tell you they'd help you win? You were putting words into his mouth. You don't have to answer that if you don't want to, Bolton. Uh, yeah. Do you have any medical training, Mr Cleaver? Uh, so, so, what's going on? Are they illegal? Of course they're not illegal. They are a health product. So what happens now, Doctor? There'll be an investigation and we'll have a urine sample. We'll have a one. It's your call. I think I've heard enough to put this result on hold. What? I won that fight clean out! OK, everyone on the coach, please. Eddie. Are you sure? Yes. Hey, hey, don't panic. Did you leave it at home? No, I don't know. Maybe. Well, then go home, see if it's there. I'll go to the school and have a look, and I'll meet you there, all right? Come on, let's move it. We'll find it. It's not the only thing I've got to worry about. The results have been postponed. What do you mean? I mean, there could be something seriously dodgy about Rob's training methods. Robot, is it? This is Davina's personal vendetta against me. What? I mean, she was just worried about you. Of course, she can't stand to see me win at anything. Please, you're going to have to let me help. What have you done? Bolton, can you wait on the coach, please? I'm going back with Cleaver. Bolton. It's been a mix-up here. A mix-up? Do you it's OK? Can you and Mike get the kids on the coach? Thanks. Nothing happened. This is a joke. OK, let's continue this back at school. Come on. Please, Jess, you're going to have to help me, please, Paul. Jasmine, we're waiting. Rob, I can only see what I'm on. We'll trade everyone in here. We can't afford these. I can always knock on doors. Come on, we're going to have to get a hostel, OK? One night and then we can sort something tomorrow. No, I'm not having Denzel going into one of those places. It's too like where he's been for the last nine weeks. OK, OK. Hey, text our Sam. Tell her to meet you. I'm going to be about an hour, OK? Why? Where are you going? I'm sorting it all right, Mum. The lad was struggling. I couldn't let him go in the ring unless he was ready. His mind had gone. He was all over the shop. So it was for Bolton's safety? Yes. Look, I admit it's not a, a method that you'd read in a coaching manual, but it worked. You gave the boy a pill and you told him he was Superman. That is not a method, Rob. That is a breach of your duty of care. After all the effort you put in, no one's questioning your commitment, but this was wrong, Rob. Simple as that. Well, in my view, what you did was at best a serious error of judgment. So when you get back next time, and after the boxing authorities have done their investigation, you'll be facing disciplinary proceedings. Until then, I... What? 
Why? Until then, I'm suspending you pending a full investigation. All I did was give the kid his five a day and a tablet, for God's sake. We've only got your word for that. It could have been a jelly bean, Rob. That's not the point, and you well, know I it. I put everything into Bolton's preparation, and I never heard you complaining. It's got nothing to do All with it. All the kudos the school would have received, and you'd have given a couple of jelly beans for that, wouldn't you, no? If you think that, you don't know me, and you don't know this school. I don't want that fight. I want it fair and square. Don't you mean Bolton won that fight, Rob? Nothing in there. Just a bit of loyalty. A bit would have been nice. And what was I going to say? Rachel's right. I mean, I plated a mess with a young boy's head just to win a boxing match. I know match. what this meant to me. I know what winning means to you. But what about Bolton? Uh, Do you get what you've even done here? It's an absurd. It wasn't the best decision I've ever made, haven't I? Have I? You've been loving your life through this. It's totally consumed you. Oh, I'm sorry, it's such a disappointment, but that is me. Well, I don't like that me. Jazz, Jazz, please. I know I've let a lot of people down. I'm sorry about that, but whatever you think about me, you cannot think that I've put Bolton at risk. Consciously, no. But you put yourself before your pupil. And that's unforgivable. That's a bit strong, isn't it? No, I don't think so. I need to go. Jazz, but... <sighs> Jazz. You and me, though, we're st still okay, right? No. You're not okay. <laughs> Mel. Look, uh, don't panic. Just get back to the school and we'll retrace your steps, all right? Yeah, well... <clears throat> I reckon we've got half an hour from when you get back here. OK. I've got to go. Well, I'll come and help. No, no, no. You stay and deal with Rob's paperwork. And enjoy. <sighs> She's probably thrown it away or something. It's pity they're not going to a country from within the EU, then. They could have used any form of photo ID. Suspended him. Oh, Jazz, come here. I'm so sorry. It's a one-way tender relationship, isn't it? Look, why don't you come round to ours tonight? Eh? We can have a good girly chat and slag him off properly. Oh. I'll be OK. You sure? Yeah, honestly. Um, someone left this on the coach. Find Rose. Should I go and get off from it from the chipper? Pudding, mushy peas, chips and gravy. I'm not even that hungry. No, what? No matter what anybody says, you won that fight. Do you hear me? That's it, John, man. No more boxing. To tell you the truth, I even like the feeling when that kid was laid out. All there. Count it if you want. 